Another year bring another opportunity for one former Patriots great to be immortalized into the Team Hall of Fame. That process begins on Thursday as the Patriots Hall of Fame committee will convene to discuss and come away with three finalists for the 2019 class. After that, those three finalists will then go in front of the fans, who will vote for this year's inductee. The Patriots Hall of Fame committee consists of veteran beat writers, reporters, team staff and Patriots Ernie Adams. As for who will be discussed and are the likely candidates to make it to the three finalists, Richard Seymour, Mike Vrabel, Rodney Harrison and Bill Parcells are the likely figures to emerge. Mike Vrabel has been a finalist for the past three years, while Seymour has been named a finalist for the past two. Harrison has never made it to the final three, while Parcells has been a finalist three times, but has never broken through. On the topic of Parcells, it's surprising that he's already not inducted as he's widely considered the second greatest coach in team history, but he will seemingly have a hard time this go-around with the strong class of players this year. Seymour, meanwhile, was a Pro Football Hall of Fame candidate last season, so he does have an extremely strong case this year. He spent the first eight seasons of his NFL career in New England after they selected him with the no. Six overall pick in the 2001 NFL Draft out of Georgia, the 6'6", 317-pounder helped deliver the team six division titles, four conference titles and three Super Bowl championships during his tenure. The defensive end's five Pro Bowl berths are the most by any Patriots defensive lineman since the merger and tallied 460 tackles to go along with 39 sacks in his time with New England. In the playoffs Seymour records 66 tackles, 4.5 sacks and one fumble recovery, in a letter lobbying for his Pro Football Hall of Fame candidacy. Bill Belichick called Seymour and Vince Wilfork the best defensive lineman he's ever coached. With Mike Vrabel, he's looked at as one of the central faces to the Patriot way during their early dynasty days and was one of the Patriots' first Swiss Army Knife players. In his eight-year stint in Foxborough, the linebacker helped the team claim three Super Bowl championship. The linebacker was as versatile as it gets when it comes to former Patriots players lining up as a middle linebacker, outside linebacker, working on special teams and even was a regular on offense in short yardage or goal line situations. He caught 10 passes in his Patriots career, including playoffs, and all 10 went for touchdowns. His 48 sacks are the seventh most in team history. Rabel also turned in a nice post-Patriots career as he's now the head coach of the Tennessee Titans. As for Harrison, he was also a key figure during two New England Super Bowl championships and was an anchor on defense for six seasons. Over the course of that time, Harrison totaled 441 tackles, 9 sacks and 8 interceptions. Last year's inductee was former Patriots offensive lineman Matt Light.